Hello and welcome to Bitcoin Smart Money. Today is Friday, August 18th, 2017. Today we're going to talk about Byteball and the next airdrop uh, that they're participating in. Right now Byteball releases an airdrop to all Bitcoin uh, shareholders every full moon and the next one's going to be happening in 19 days. So I figured I'd be able to put this out and allow you guys a few days to get rolling um, before they take the snapshot of the blockchain. So what I'm going to do is show you how to do it with a ledger wallet and there's a couple ways to do it but let's go over really uh, what's happening here so in 19 days they're going to distribute uh, Byteball and the technology behind Byteball is pretty cool however the problem with airdrops is when they do this these uh, you know I guess we'll call them uh, coins or tokens what have you when they do this the people that receive the uh, payments they usually just send them to an exchange and sell it sell it off and we can see that with the chart it's happened uh, you know, in July it happened really hard and happened this past August uh, extremely. The, the coin was over $700 and now we're trading at you know, 370 or even lower. Uh, so what it is is it's con conditional smart payments and it allows you to do a lot with their wallet. They have uh, P2P payments and chat. You could sell Bitcoins for Byteball. You can go Byteball to Bitcoins through the chat bot. You can make predictions. Uh, you can create smart contracts. It's, it's pretty cool what you can do, uh, kind of like binary options, uh, P2P insurance. Uh, I mean, the technology behind Byball is awesome. So I think once the airdrops stop and the full supply of the coin is out, it could be something that's worth considering looking at. But until the selling pressure is out of this coin, it's going to continue to get hurt. But, you know, let's, that's no reason to not take advantage of of what this coin offers and the free Bitcoin or altcoin that you can get. So the first thing you're going to want to do is is get a Byteball wallet. You can get it for, you know, I recommend doing it on a computer. It's just much easier. Windows or Mac. Uh, I've done it on Windows seamlessly for the August distribution, but we're going to do it here on Mac uh, just to, to show Mac users how it works. And you can see here the ninth round is scheduled for the full moon on September 6th at uh, 702 UTC so just plug that into Google and you can find out what it is for your time zone so for every 16 bitcoins you're gonna get 0.1 uh, gigabyte looks like and let's see what it's trading at today so we're at 363 and you know it's not gonna be a, a ton of money but it's gonna be something and if you turn it into Bitcoin or an alt that goes up tremendous in value uh, whether it's new ICO that hits Bittrex or whether you just want to hold it for the safe investment of Bitcoin, I think it, it's worth doing because it only takes a few minutes, as you'll see. So let's go through it. Uh, you can go to this page, uh, dailybyteball.blogspot.com, and check out really, you know, what Byteball is, all the features of it, wallets, exchanges. I mean, there's just a host of information on this page uh, that could help, you know, someone that's interested in the technology long term, or someone that just wants to understand how the airdrop works. So. Once you've downloaded your wallet, let's go check it out. I'm going to be doing it here with a 5 Bitcoin wallet address. I've plugged in a ledger, but you can just import your private keys to Electrum. It's really easy. And once you do that, you're going to go into... Let's go home here so you can see. This is my YouTube demo wallet. You're just going to go into either receive or chat. But let's do chat because it just makes it easy. And you're going to click insert my address and then you're going to sign and verify the message here but what you need to do first is copy your Bitcoin address so I did that and we're gonna now paste that into the transition bot so you can see that address matches that And so it has it. So now what it's going to ask us to do is to sign this message with our ledger. And what's cool about the ledger is you actually have to physically push a button for the ledger to send Bitcoins or to sign messages. So if there's a hacker who has access to your computer, keylogger, they're not going to be able to steal your Bitcoins, which is what I really like about the, um, the ledger wallet. You know, Electrum is pretty secure. You can encrypt the wallet. You can set up a password feature. However, having the physical touch of a hardware wallet is almost unbeatable. So what we'll do here is we're going to sign this message. We're going to copy what we're supposed to sign. We're going to click our address here. 
We're going to sign and verify the message. And it, it has our address that we need to sign. And here's the message. Now all we're going to do is click sign. The ledger is now going to ask us to sign the message. I'm just going to hit that button. It's going to pop out a signature. You can cut or copy. Paste that in. Hit enter. And the signature is OK. So it's going to tell us here how much we're going to receive. And looks like we've completed that. So I'll do that for the next few. But that's all you have to do for this bite ball distribution airdrop. Make sure you get it in before the next full moon. Thank you, everybody. Have a great day. Hit me up on the DM at, at Bitcoin BTC Smart Money or check me out at www.bitcoinsmartmoney.com. Thanks a lot.